Pete, sum up tonight's game for us. Yeah, it was like it was, we had the puck a lot, but um, yeah, they Shane on a good game. They battled. I think the second period we took the game over and that was enough. You know, we got three and three this weekend, so we got to. The good thing was we got Riley back. He's two months out. He's done a really good job out there. He's been for a long time. He's been working hard. Um, we get Olszewski back, we get McWilliam back. We're still playing with 5D, I thought they'd done a good job. It's a lot of work, but you know, it was good to get through it. I think it's the most important thing. And Five tonight did a really good job of kind of clogging up that neutral zone, making it difficult for you guys to play. And when a game is like that, is is your, are you kind of just telling the players, keep at it, keep maybe just trying maybe slightly different things and eventually it will work as it did tonight? Yeah, I think it's just being patient and not forcing things. And then when we didn't do that, we took over the game, but they're, they're dangerous, you know, on, on their day. They, they, they can they blow out everywhere, so it's, they get chances. Um, uh, yeah, I thought we were fine. Do you know, it was those games are tough though. Uh, there's no easy games in this league, and they had a tough night on Wednesday night. And I always think when that happens to a team, they always come back with a pushback. And I thought they did have a pushback. You know, they travelled a long way down here. They're short. I know how they feel. We had it on Sunday night. We played with the 4D. It's tough, really tough for the players. But yeah, we're happy. Do you know what I mean? We got a, another one, so you just got to keep chalking them off as much as you can. You got to be happy with any one you get. And a word tonight, Jared Gordy, we felt up in commentary, we did a really good job blocking shots, had a little bit of time on the power play as well because of, you know, you guys being out on here and stuff. And just a word on him tonight and, and the commitment, even in like a three game weekend, still committed to just playing a hundred percent every game. Yeah, he's one of our youngest players. I think people forget that, but he took him a lot of time to settle. You know, he comes to a new country, a new league, it's all different for him. He's one of the young guys now, you know, and it's probably hard for him, but we've worked hard with him, you know, and he's I thought the last maybe six games he's really started to play you know you can see what he is he's a solid player um he can fight to get in the pp do you know what i mean he does a good job there but he's he's fearless do you know he's puts his body in the line and it's uh, like, like a lot of our players do but yeah it's good for jared do you know he's starting to settle and i think he's going to get better and better and finally you, you mentioned obviously three and three it's nottingham tomorrow and, and what have you got to do differently maybe just to avoid that kind of frustration tomorrow i just think we got to be on do you know i think our habits have to be a little bit better I think we opened the game up a little bit tonight and we got playing in the wrong side a little bit sometimes so we give away some rushes. I think tomorrow we got to be on the ball, we got to be solid, um, completely sober on the road. You can't play like that um, and it's going to be a good game. They're always good games in Nottingham, they're a really good team, you know, they won a lot of games just now. But you know, we want to get through it, the biggest thing is get through, stay healthy, come back on Sunday. We'll see you Sunday, thank you. See you later, thank you.